Hi, I'm Michael Dulcy here to talk to you about our new EFIN. The EFIN is a 10 inch fin powered by a lithium battery that attaches to any SUP center fin box. Let's talk about what we have here a little bit more. So the E-fin itself, again, is 10 inches, magnetic motor, operated by a remote control. The remote control, as you see here, starts the fin, powers at four speeds, has power up, power down, and kill switch. It goes into any standard center fin box that's a longboard box. And it can go into an inflatable type or a hardboard type that you see over here. That's our glider. So this is a aftermarket uh, inflatable fin box. So this could actually be laminated or glued onto a kayak or canoe. EFIN is great for fishing, outstanding as a power booster, uh, power assist, if you will. So keep that in mind. Your customers will want this. The battery is a lithium battery. It's waterproof. You see a screw here, so it comes sealed. It keeps it waterproof. Never take the screw out. Never go into this compartment. It will void the warranty. Now, on the battery, you see a connection port. So the cable will go under the board onto the battery, into the battery port connection. That is a thin connection into the port. Next is an on off switch. If the switch is down towards the first slash, it's on. Therefore, your fin works. There's a second port on the back side of the battery, and that's for your charger. All this comes standard with your, your uh, E-Fin. E-Fin has an MSRP of only $599. Now, you notice I have this box, that is the, the battery box, tethered to the board via a strap. <clears throat> I have it underneath the carry handle, so it's on tight. So if I didn't have tie-down straps, that is plugs, that the straps would work in on the board, which I do have on the glider over here, then I would have to strap all the way around the board. And that's a case sometimes you have to do that. Uh, I usually have the strap in front of the fin, and it secures the battery so that it doesn't go anywhere. So it looks like this if it's to a RE board and all our boards come with tie down plugs in the rear and the front of the board. This is our gliders I said 11.4. In the rear of the board there's security plugs. Those security plugs have allowed me to use a standard uh, strap that is a, a cam lock webbing strap and I've tethered the battery to the board. Also you see where I've gone underneath the board with the cable from the fin into the uh, connection in the battery for the power for the fin. This uh, system is the best that you can get. Again, at $599, this will power a board over five miles an hour for up to six hours. And cost under six hundred dollars. So it's going to come in a box that is uh, a point of sale box. It'll have warranty information and uh, papers telling you how to hook it up to your board. Here's a picture, as you can see, of the 
board under power. If you look at the trail back here, you see that it's been going for a while. The board's been going for a while. This is a easy water nine foot four with the E fin. Just chugging along. There's a little video. And on this, I'm on a four man inflatable. So, and I'm going at a good pace. It's so stable, and I may be going a few miles an hour, that one could do sup yoga. So, contact us for more information on the e-board and the e-fin.